for me personally, you know, you can't go 20 years without some ups and downs, but I've never really hit a deep lull in anything where I, you know, where I'm not happy with what I'm doing. All it has been is, at worst, maybe a little bit of malaise at some time. But for the most part, it's, you know, it's just amazingly awesome. The, the job that we have, creating things out of nothing. It's, you know, we're magicians working with ethereal stuff and creating worlds. And, you know, I love the programming and the development probably more now than I ever did before. There was a sense, it's hard to almost go back before the thought of the internet, information at your fingertips. And in many ways, I almost felt off in the wilderness figuring things out as I went. You know, not knowing, of course, that there are books of knowledge that were available at universities, but it wasn't at my fingertips and I was kind of figuring it all out myself. And that's something that you don't get in the current scheme of things, but because everything is out there and a lot of times it's more important to find things rather than to invent things. But the, you know, the craft of software development is something that I, I feel probably more strongly about today than ever before. And I've gotten to work with a lot of really amazing people, programmers, artists, and developers of all kinds. So I get asked a lot over the last five, 10 years, you know, people here, I'm working with rocketry and other stuff there. I'm like, I hear, well, are you gonna quit it and go work on rockets? And usually I say, people don't understand that almost any discipline like that doesn't have a fraction of the breadth of what we deal with in building games. And it sounds trivial that, okay, we're building these entertainment applications, things that people spend their odd moments on, but the truth is it's incredibly sophisticated and detailed, and you can talk about you know, moonshots and things like that, and I can say, well, our software is a hell of a lot more sophisticated than anything that went into putting people on the moon, and I'm more interested by the challenges of the things that we do here than just about anything else I can think of. I mean, it is true at my heart, I'm an engineer more than I am a, you know, a gamer specifically. I, I have great love of games in so many ways, but I could do other things, but I still think this is actually the best place for me to be working and the best things for me to be working on. And we're really happy <laughs> that you do that. Uh, all right. Um, we are going to be taking some questions, so if you have